So we're currently in the anechoic chamber. We're setting up this demonstration, uh, which is a multi-zone loudspeaker system. So this is, rather than a normal speaker, which fills a room with sound, this can send sound in different directions. And so as we walk around this loudspeaker, we get uh, different sounds being sent out into the different locations. So with this, uh, there's all sorts of uh, applications we can use. Uh, I'm particularly interested in private audio. So in a public space, rather than uh, a private conversation, say through a security screen or an announcement in a train station, rather than that just being uh, heard by everyone, maybe you want to target a specific person. In the case of hearing impairments, if someone's watching TV uh, and they haven't got as good hearing as the next person, you can send some more sound towards them so that everyone enjoys the experience. And we can go further and say, if two people speak different languages or they prefer to listen in a different language, we can send those different soundtracks to different seats on a sofa and everyone can enjoy hearing in their own language. Der Aufbau der Berliner Philharmonie ist asymmetrisch und zeltartig mit einem großen Konzertsaal, dessen Grundriss auf dem Prinzip von dreimal aneinander versetzt ist. Furthermore, it is possible to listen behind optical barriers and in the darkness. These special features, among other things, lead many engineers and physicists, particularly those in the field of communication, I'm taking it to France for the launch of the International Year of Sound, uh, where we're going to demonstrate it to the public. So the International Year of Sound is uh, a series of events that run all throughout 2020 that uh, basically expose acoustics to the public. So we go around and we demonstrate not just things like loudspeakers, but also the, the breadth of acoustics. 